with coach Jacques Ninaba's decision to back three backline players on the bench once more. However, Yankees returns to the box squad for this Saturday's clash against Australia and Adelaide. With Franz Steyn also included on the bench, Yankees will be the specialist fly half cover for Andre Pollard, who has started the last four tests for the box. It's a great opportunity, you know. I don't think a lot of teams in the history had, a, had the opportunity to, to go back to back against uh, the All Blacks. And, and I, I guess we put us, um, for us, the positive um, uh, out of that game is uh, we got ourselves in a hole uh, in the first half, um, being 15 0 down, but we clawed our way back. And I, and I think it was uh, about 72 or 73 minutes on the clock where we were leading the game with them having uh, going down to 14 men. Ninaba was probed on Yankees including at his team announcement press on Monday. And while he acknowledged it was difficult to assess players who have had limited game time, he was confident that 32-year-old would easily and vastly be improved against Australia. Yeah, no, um, yeah obviously the, 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 um, the, the changes, if I take it from, from fullback uh, or from 15, is uh, obviously Warwick is in for Jesse. Uh, um, we got in, we got concussed uh, when we played um, New Zealand, and then Faf is back um, after his concussion and his return to play has finished. So um, uh, we're bringing him in, and then uh, yeah, we went with a five-three split. And again, um, the reason for that is uh, yeah, some uh, we've got uh, we feel uh, tactically that's what we will need when uh, if we play against uh, when we play against Australia. In other significant news, Warwick Khalan starts at right wing in place of the concussed Jesse Creel, while Fafta Clack returns at scrum half as Jaden Herringser moves to the bench. Kickoff on Saturday is at half past seven. Malana Sekan for Soweto TV Sports.